often said that uh, you will go from stability to investment to momentum to acceleration. So is the acceleration phase here to stay? Will it continue beyond FY22? So thanks, uh, Chandra, for uh, this session. Uh, I think what you're describing is what we put together over the past three years, really uh, making sure that we are building out all of those capabilities uh, in digital, which our clients are looking for. Uh, my sense is uh, today there's a tremendous amount of demand uh, for those digital and cloud capabilities. Uh, and as you saw in the last quarter, that's now more than half of our business and growing at about 30%. Uh, given that sort of attraction, my sense is uh, that will have good uh, continuing momentum for some time. Of course, it means we have to continually uh, keep the capability building going and work closely with clients to make sure that we're delivering what their needs are, what their digital and cloud transformation programs are. At the same time, making sure our employees are getting all the reskilling to make all of these programs happen. Right. So are we then staring at a multi-year cycle of double-digit growth? Because, you know, in uh, recent interactions, you have spoken about how IT has moved beyond a cost driver to a business driver for global corporations. So are we looking at a multi-year cycle of double-digit growth, something that will perhaps uh, continue for FY23, FY24 and so on? So there, uh, I think you're right. Uh, our view is that many large enterprises are now looking at IT, not just to improve various components of their performance, but also to look for growth from their own customers, uh, increase the efficiency of their supply chain, make sure that their connection with their people is much more agile and stronger. And those are more in the nature of investing for the growth for the transformation of their large enterprises. Uh, we think that sort of a trend will continue for some time. Of course, uh, we, we've not spoken about uh, anything becoming multi-year in terms of our own growth. We've been very clear to say that next year, uh, we see double-digit growth for Infosys. 